highly recommend these. They are the cold and hot ice packs for your boobies. Like doesn't cover very much compared to a folded receiving blanket. Next thing that I like to have on hand, I think I really enjoy shopping for a baby boy. <laughs> because if y'all can't tell, he <laughs> got lots of clothes. another video if you are new here my name is Vanessa I am pregnant with baby number two I am currently it is gonna be 20 weeks tomorrow when you guys see this I'll probably be about 20 21 weeks and I am so excited but we have gotten so much for baby boy already I've gotten gifted things already I've gotten um, hand-me-downs I've gotten stuff from like thrift stores and Goodwills and I've just like got a bunch of stuff from everywhere and I have no idea what we have right now and I don't, I I need to look at, oh, easy baby, I need to look at all the sizing, I need to look at like how many blankets and swaddles and uh, burp cloth, stuff like that I have so then I can figure out what we are going to need. So let's open up all these bags. I'm going to do a time lapse and open everything up and then I will check back in with you guys and see exactly what we have and tell you guys kind of like what else I'm wanting to get that we don't have. Everything is laid out. I have it all separated. I'll go through it in just a second. But I cannot believe how much we have gotten gifted and the hand-me-downs that... Oh, I'm getting emotional. The hand-me-downs that I get to put my baby in that somebody else's baby got to wear. I love it. Um, I've gotten brand new things. I've gotten um, thrifted stuff that other babies have been in um also i just love getting to have like memories on all of these things i wanted to let you guys know that if you hear like coloring or noise in the background i do have a toddler that is just playing and doing her own thing so she might pop in here and there but let's get going on what we have. I wanted to start out by listing a few things that I have from Mariana that we're using for the baby. Um, I have a list on my phone. I'm going to read the list of what's on there and then I will go through what we have here 
then I will share what's on my registry. So a lot of like basically everything that we have and that I am giving and using to the baby from Mariana is pretty basic minimal like needs for the baby which I'm super excited about. So if you guys need help with the registry, these are items that I would put on a registry. These are items that are on my registry. Um, what do you need help with? You want to sit with mommy? No. Is it right here? No. No? What do you need help with? Oh, you need mommy to get up? What do you need help with? Hmm. Oh, she wants me to color with her. She wants help coloring. It's okay. Mommy's gonna finish the video, okay? Mommy's almost done. Here, do you wanna help mommy read the list? So this is what we have from Mariana that we are handing down to the baby and using again because we kept it because we knew we were gonna have more than one. We have a, okay, so everything that's listed here isn't here. I'm going to show everything that we have here, obviously. But we have a bobby for breastfeeding. We have a swing for the baby. We have the car seat and stroller combo from her. Never got in an accident. Not worried about it at all. Um, we have baby bottles. Pacifier clips. Some are girly, but most of them are pretty neutral. Um... Bedside bassinet, I actually just got that. Um, or you can do the pack and play. So I would, I would honestly, we're doing the bedside bassinet just because we've used the pack and play bassinet and the pack and play itself. And I liked both of them, but I wanted to this time around do something different and see if it's helpful, if it's not. Um, but I will definitely be talking about that in a later video once the baby's here saying like if it's worth it or if I should have just used the pack and play. But I have both of those. Um, bathtub. I have, I think, two different bathtubs. I was going to probably gift one away. I wasn't a fan of it. I love the bucket bathtub. I wish that I can like show you guys it. Um, it is my favorite for all ages from like being little that like, you can fit in it amazing I love it we have like thermometer nail clips nail clipper stuff like that from her we have teethers humidifier tummy time mat the black and white boards for tummy time I highly recommend those I feel like they were a huge help for her getting her attention and looking up and using those muscles. It was, it was memories. We have a walker, um, one that she can sit in or one that he can sit in and then another one that he can like once he starts walking. Um, we have a jumper. Mariana loved that thing. She constantly was in it, just adored it. I'm super excited for the baby to use it. And then we do have some bibs. Um, she has girly bibs, but then I have some pretty neutral ones too. But I don't think it really matters because it's going to be covered and spit up anyways. And then I will go through what we still need after I go through all of this. So what we still need is basically what's on the registry as a second time mom. Um, it's not very much. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's about like 10, 10 to 15 things that are on there that just would like help out. Um, but we basically have everything. I'm super excited. I wanna go through a list of like what we have for the baby. And then I want to go through and like show you guys the cute like individual items. We have a huge stack of swaddles. I'm super excited about. Let's see, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight swaddles. So we are set on swaddles. Highly recommend these. They're like the um, the Muslim swaddles. We have. 
a, um, I think she called them like receiving blankets, but specifically they're like the perfect size for burp cloth. I don't recommend buying those like small little like dainty pack of burp cloths that are like, I think there's one in here that she gave me. I'll show you the difference of the sizes. So this is a receiving blanket that I'm gonna use as a burp cloth. It's big enough to cover your whole shoulder if you wanted to, if you wanna burp like that. The size of the burp cloth, as you can see, does I feel like barely goes over my shoulder, which I've had throw up down my back before. And it like doesn't cover very much compared to a folded receiving blanket. And then if you wanna just that extra wipe up, you just, you have it, which is just super nice. I love all of these receiving blankets. I got quite a few from her because she said that she never, she never really used them. So I have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, I think seven, I've got seven of those, which is super nice, perfect little amount to have on hand. And then she also gave us some bassinet and changing pad covers, which is always nice to have as extras. I have um, shoes, so I was gifted shoes, and I've gotten some moccasins when I was out and about. The next thing is sleepers. So I like to use the sleep sacks with the no arms. Those were Mariana's favorite and I felt the most comfortable having her in them. And it's something that she can't get wrapped up in. The swaddle can't come off of her. Um, the blanket can't suffocate her. I knew that she was warm and was sleeping very safely in these. So I have a couple of these. This is the one that's a hand-me-down from Mariana's um, sleep sack. I have a couple more in storage too for baby boy. I believe these are some little like... Um, like robes, they're not necessary, but they're cute. <laughs> oh, I wanted to go through the breastfeeding stuff I had. Um, I have my electric pump that plugs into the wall. Um, I have some like samples of some covers because I bought the reusable nursing pads. Highly recommend those. Got um, just some sample ones. I got, let's see, oh, highly recommend these, but I didn't put it on the registry because I already have it from Mariana. They are the cold and hot ice packs for your boobies when you're breastfeeding. <coughs> Nipple shields, I am thinking of getting new ones for the baby though. I don't know if I can like reuse these. <coughs> I'll have to see. Plus, I want to be properly sized. So I have a couple sizes that I might use for the lactation consultant, the LC, to size me. And then I'll probably just buy the ones that I need. But I'm hoping the baby doesn't give me any problems. I have some Mom Cozy pumps that I was not a fan of, so I don't even know if I'm going to be using those again. Did not like them. Next thing that I like to have on hand. Are you eating your cookie? I got this little organizer for baby for like by the bed or in our room that's just going to hold the things that I don't want to like run to Mariana's room for either in the middle of the night or just like throughout the day. But okay, well Sergio got me a little <laughs> belly casting kit, but that's not what I grabbed it for. I grabbed it to show you guys the teethers. So Mariana loved the like mushroom teether. This teether, the Komotomo teether, perfect. Um, there's like little wooden silicone ones in here I'm super excited about. There is a few pacifier clips 
that are more girly and probably just going to use for like toys and stuff but like here at the house not when we're out and about so then people aren't like oh she's cute and i'm like he's a boy um pacifiers that mariana never used that if the if he'll take them it'll be nice to have extra ones around but i specifically am wanting to get the man pacifiers they're the best shape for the mouth mariana's never had any problems with her teeth um they are like the best pacifiers to me that i want my baby using and then i just have hand me down crocs and then a couple of the ones you can put in the fridge that get cold. Highly recommend these. For sure would be on my registry if I didn't already have a couple. And then here are some pacifier clips for him. There's a blue llama, chevron, stars. These are like the ones I'm super excited about. I already have them. That was on my list of what I already have. But that's about it, that's all in here. Oh, a random little soap container from Mariana. But that is that. Let's see if I can get that up there without falling back on me. Another thing that I highly recommend is, um, it's general term is a baby lounger, which means that you can put him in a lounging um, pillow that you can take throughout the house so then you're not like laying him on the couch so he can fall off or like putting him on the kitchen table in like a very uncomfortable position i would recommend getting a lounger so with mariana we got a cheap one off of amazon was not a fan of it super hard to clean ridiculous i was looking at the snuggle me organics online i had it on my amazon registry fully washable stick it right into the washing machine and you can sanitize it clean it do whatever you need to do and i um, am just going to use like a swaddle throw it over it supervised obviously um and i can just bring them throughout the house highly recommend a lounger whatever you get brand whatever it is you don't have to spend over a hundred dollars on one that's the price of a snuggle me I think I said we spent like 30, 30, 40 dollars on one for Mariana and it worked just fine. It was just was a B word to clean and all of the above. I have a sling, like a, like a baby carrier sling. You just stick it around. It's a little tight right now. And then you put baby right in here. And then I was hoping to uh, breastfeed and um, baby wear him. If we're like out in public and I already have him in here, I'm going to see if that would work. I'm super excited about that. But I highly recommend a um, baby carrier in general. I have the Moby wraps. I have a um, like a buckle clip on one that you can like turn around face forward you know like tummy to tummy i have that one that worked really good that's when i used with her and then i also used a sling for when i wanted a supported hip hold supported hip hold with her loved it for that and then, and then specifically she's reading her book specifically i want it for breastfeeding I'm hoping that that would be comfortable. The next thing that I made sure that we had for baby was sleepers. So I personally feel like the first three months is going to be living in sleepers. Mainly because he's, excuse me, mainly because he's gonna be a December baby, which means that it's gonna be like the first three months are gonna be like the colder months, which is perfect but i also wanted to have them because it's something that i'm comfortable just throwing on and i know that they're warm and i know that their feet are covered and i know that it's just needs if like if they're if he's cold just an extra blanket thrown on top but i don't have to like layer and layer and layer him i'm just one layer and he should be good we keep the house too at like about like 70 
which is perfect for the baby and perfect for us. <laughs> so sleepers, made sure that we got sleepers. And then, and then while I was making sure we had sleepers, I got a bunch of other clothes too. And that's what I wanna share with you guys is all the super cute clothes that we have so far. And then I also need to go through and size everything so then I can figure out what's going in the top of the closet versus what I'm going to go put inside the dresser. Um, there's just so many things. I don't even know what we have. But I know that we what got, the, I don't think I got anything over 12 months. So it, that's going to be nice. I have a huge range from 0 to 12 months. And I posted that I don't want any clothes for like the baby shower, baby sprinkle because we clearly have plenty, probably too much. I feel like this video is just a whole lot of me talking and I'm not used to like just like talking and talking and talking in the videos. And so I'm like, da, just... da, da. I feel like I like need to stop talking. <laughs> da, da, da. Yeah, are you talking? Yeah. Oh. You got a cookie on your face. <gasps> is that a hummingbird? Mom is like getting hot sitting here, talking. Mm. Ah! Now I'm going to go through each pile and show you guys specifically the patterns and the colors and the styles and like everything that I got. I want to go through all of the Goodwill things that I've picked up which is two swaddles. I got a super cute tree swaddle and then some like mountains and trees from Goodwill. I'm just gonna lay everything on my chest so you guys can see it, but I'm not going to like go through each individual clothing item. I've gotten lots of sweaters, long sleeve onesies because he's gonna be born in December. Anywhere between probably December 1st, anywhere to maybe the first week of January, but that be that I would be like uh, like a week late. So it's gonna be cold. So I got lots of cold things. We got sleep sack. I have gotten a couple of these actually, which I'm super excited about. They are the kimono onesies that open up I'll open up this one that open up on the side and then completely open up so I can do skin to skin without taking out his little arms and taking it off of like his diaper I can just open it up and still have like a warm skin to skin which I'm kind of excited about I am going to definitely be doing that for breastfeeding I've gone quite a few of those it's a really good find. Um, definitely got some of these pants. Highly recommend these pants with the footsies. My go-to with Mariana. I found one pack of them at Target one time and have not been able to find any online. Haven't been able to find very, like any at all. And these are like the same material as the pants. They just have little feet. Highly recommend these. I've got some sleepers, a couple sets, more sleepers, a few onesies. Let's see, I got another couple of pants, some regular pants. I got a couple moccasins. These are my favorite to find at the Goodwill. Is these super cute little moccasins for when they're like in the, um, if we go outside and put them in like the jumper outside or like the little sit sitting walker outside and they're not quite like walking but they need their feet protected from the concrete. I love to put them in the little moccasins, my favorite. And for more sleepers, sleeper. Oh, I found a couple cute like rubbers almost, but I'm like boy rubbers. I'm gonna make that overall super cute. Another one here. I that was cute. And cute little cows. I thought that was so cute. We have now the hand-me-downs. We'll go through the hand-me-downs. I got, okay, like I said before, I feel like the Goodwill stuff is hand-me-downs. Um, I separated the brand new things from, you have to stop, please, honey. 
I separated like the brand new things with the tags on um, from Goodwill and I put it in the brand new pile that um, had like tags. All of the rest of the stuff is going to be like hand-me-downs and stuff that I got from other moms. All the swaddles receiving Why? blankets, the shoes, Why? and the robes Why? were all... They were all gifted to me from my awesome, amazing friend, Lauren. And I feel like we have like the, like the same vibe. So I love all the patterns. Let's go through what I got from the uh, Facebook mama that um, they were like a dollar each, I think I said. So we got a sleeper. These are all sleepers. So I'll go through the sleeper pile first. Most of these are like Gerber, Cloud Island from Target. This is like a cute little pack from, from Target. It's got mountains, arrows, stars. I like, I love these ones. Those are my favorite ones. Got a little dinosaur. Cute little plaid one. And then this little bear one, it says, it says bear cheeks on the butt. Oh my gosh, is that not the cutest? And then I found this padded, it's six to nine. It's from Baby Gap. It's like a bundle sleeper. I thought this would be perfect for like camping. Keep a little extra warm because I don't know if we need that extra warmth inside the house unless it's like a really cold night. So those are all the sleepers I got from her. Then I got a cute little bundle of neutral onesies and long sleeve onesies and some pants from her. And they all range, I think, from zero to six months. So I got these super cute. I think this kimono might go to the hospital with us. I'm loving this olive green. Oh, love the olive greens. That is a onesie. I got kimono, onesie, onesie, onesie. We got pants, pants. There's a pants I put down here earlier. A pair of pants. Another kimono. I was even thinking about maybe bringing this one. It's a little bit bigger than the other one for the hospital. This one says, I can change the world. It's another kimono. And then I got a kimono, kimono. And then there's this super cute little like jumpsuit looking thing. The other sack from Facebook Marketplace I think this is the only other stack. I've only gotten two bundles from Facebook Marketplace, but this is one of my favorites. Winnie the Pooh. And then, new to the herd, y'all, listen, this is the cutest set. I'm so excited. And then a Nike set. I'm not sure if I'm gonna use this one. Might re-gift it. New to the crew, mighty cute. As you can see, I love the dinosaurs. I like went all the dinosaur out. Cuddlesaurus. A little neutral moment, brown. And then we got one, two, three, a four pack of pants. Oh. Are you want to show them yours? Yeah. I got these jumpsuits. They are super cute. They have little like wagons and trucks with surfboards. And then the other one is like a beach hut, little beach, palm tree, sand, super stinking cute. And then this was the last set of that bundle. I couldn't believe how stinking cute that is. Mm -hmm. And then I don't know why this is in here. I got this brand new. It should be in like the brand new pile. I got this one to Ross. It says, Mama's Little Man, not as much little forest animals. That is what I got from Facebook Marketplace. Now we're going to move into what Lauren gifted us. Look at that. Look how stinking cute this swaddle is. And then like with this color, oh. <gasps> you know what? That cute kimono would go perfect with this swaddle color. Let me grab it out so I can have it set aside. That cute little kimono with, I think that'd be super cute. I'm gonna set that aside. And then I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring that one too. I think these two swaddles for the hospital that outfit oh this is kind of small it's newborn i don't think it's gonna fit but i am going to be packing i think three three different sizes of outfits just in case the baby comes out different different size swaddle we got this cute little like leaf pattern swaddle light blue blue like a dark blue swaddle this super cute like leafy green and then a white swaddle. I was super excited. I forgot to say it in the beginning with like everything that we have for the baby. I got a 
boppy pillow cover from Lauren. I'm super excited about their cactuses. And then I got this. It's a car seat breastfeeding cover like combo. Do not mess with the clothes. Here, do you want to play with this? Look how cute. Oh, it's upside down. So it just goes like right over. It's like a little tube. It goes right over the car seat. But then I also can throw it on like this. And then breastfeed and cover like whatever boob he's on. It smells like Lauren. <laughs> yeah. I am really excited about that. Yeah. Do you want to smell it? It smells like Lauren. And then all like the receiving blankets I'm gonna use burp cloths. These, these are our burp cloths. I'm not gonna buy a pack of them because I have plenty. She also gifted us the bassinet. Please be careful. The bassinet changing table covers. There's a little Winnie the Pooh one. And then a cute like boy llama one. And then these super cute little hangers for the closet. Tell me like what size they are. Please be careful. These are hand-me-downs from Mariana. It's AZ for Swaddle, the bassinet cover. I highly recommend these changing pad covers for the changing pads so you don't have to replace the entire changing pad cover. These literally just fit right in the middle of the changing pad. And I like to use the like waterproof side and I would just wipe up the spills and it would save a whole changing pad cover. I just use little like mid cut, like little small slips. These are amazing to have. These are super cute little like moccasin shoes that I got from her. I knew Sergio was gonna want these, so I grabbed these. I think this is a Walmart brand, but these are super cute. I didn't know that Walmart had like little cute shoes like that. And a little croc, so we are set on shoes. We don't need any more shoes. And then look how stinking cute. She said that he never wore it because he doesn't keep hats on, but I could not, I said, I want that. She was like, <laughs> it fits you? Look, oh my goodness, that is so stinking cute. I might have to get one for her so we can match. That's so cute, baby. <laughs> yeah. yeah, don't put it back on. Here you go, I'm go. Go color. That is all of that that was gifted. Our little like washcloths that I got for the baby and like miscellaneous uses, but it's the B to match his baby shower patterns. And it's like a 12 by 12, but I'm super excited to use it for like bath time and to have around the house for a little like cleanups, but they're washable. Baby, baby, mama's baby. This video is all over and I really hope that everybody like watches from like beginning to end because there's so much tips, so many tips and advice and stuff you guys should use and stuff that things that I, I loved and I hope that you guys use and love. Uh, but okay, let's get back into the video. Uh, last pile I wanna show you guys. I'm super excited about is all of the cute little Target stuff. I got a few sleepers. Are you okay? Yeah. No, you're not okay. This pile is like too far for me. I'm gonna stick it right here. I got sleepers. This oh, Tractor Supply. I got a couple things from Tractor Supply. This is a pink Carhartt. That's super freaking cute. I got a pack of beanies. I really recommend beanies on your registry. Another little sleeper. So this was one that had the tags on it from Goodwill, but I only paid $2 each for this pack of long sleeve onesies. Brand new, still have the plastic and the stickers on it. I was super excited. I got this from Target, little Winnie the Pooh pack. These are all from Target. I think it says a little love. So cute. Little. Mommy's almost done. <laughs> this is a pack from Goodwill that's brand new again. It has the plastic on it and the tags. I love this set, this blue mama set. Oh, and it's like gray. Adore it. Hola. These are super cute from Target. They're like a little knot. I couldn't pass those up. A, let's see. And it's like the baby Yoda. I think it's the Grow Group. Grow Group. Somebody correct me. I think that's what it's called. But it's a little sweater, pants set. And then it comes with a long sleeve onesie so then I can like pair, like do two outfits out of full. Well, that's one, two, three outfits out of one little bundle. I thought these were cute. This I think was the biggest size. I got 12 months in these because I couldn't pass up the price. 
I got a lot of this stuff on sale. I mainly hit the clearance for Target. That's the only reason why I bought brand new was I hit the clearance. All right, I'm gonna run out of time here soon. But these are super cute. This is a super cute little bundle I found on sale too. That's from Target. This is a kind of a car little thing I got from Trash Display. And then I got this. I paid brand new full price for this because I could not pass it up. Oh my gosh. And then it comes with the pants. I think I really enjoyed shopping for a baby boy. <laughs> because if y'all can't tell, he got lots of clothes. That is it. I can't believe the video is over. I think that's all that I have to show you guys. We say bye. We'll see you in the next. Thank you for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope that it helps someone with their baby registry and I hope you um, got some good tips and oh, oh are you okay? Um, good tips and advice for your baby and I'm excited I got to share all this with you guys and we will see you in the next.